water sport operators on Liuzhou Island could face fines of up to 150,000 NT if they don't clear the beach by the end of the day. Leaving equipment such as paddle boards and kayaks on the beach overnight can get in the way of turtles hoping to nest on the beach. They could also cause baby turtles to have trouble going into the ocean after they hatch from the egg. A splash in the sea to ward off the heat, Liuzhou Island is a top destination for the summer break. Among the aquatic fun, you can do kayaking and stand-up paddleboarding, which has recently become very popular. But all these installations on the beach are causing problems. All these things get in the way of female turtles when they come up. The equipment strewn about takes up a significant area of the beach, leaving the turtles with no places to lay their eggs. When the turtles come ashore at night to lay their eggs, they might bump into things or get stuck. All this recreational equipment and bigger discarded items can also impact the baby turtles after they hatch and make their way to the sea. After we're done with the day, we pack away all the stand-up paddle boards at our shop. Though most of the businesses in the area do take their equipment back, some less scrupulous operators leave their kayaks and boards on the beach. Locals called up the relevant agencies to clear the area. Yes, in the, uh, operators are required to remove all their things from the beach at 5 p.m. Those who don't will be fined between 30,000 to 150,000 NT in accordance with the Fishing Port Act. To protect expecting turtles and preserve their nesting grounds, operators who don't free the beach for the animals will face heavy fines.